Good day, beautiful souls. This is Isis. Today I'm going to talk about six words, six words that will change your life. So around 2015, um, the human farm of which I am presently in had quite a tribulation take place. And within that, um, she had to search to discover something and some way to enhance herself and reach to the higher self. So what took place was some individuals, uh, she was living in Pakistan, and some individuals had not liked that an American be with in their family bloodlines. So they chose to give some special product, which is unknown, um, to this human form. And that made, very, that made me very sick. Um, in fact, I was dying and I was at, no, I was at 83 pounds uh, one and a half years later. Um, no, nothing I ate would increase my weight and in extreme poverty to the point of, I would uh, put it classification as homeless, but not living on the street itself. Um, any material possession had been removed and basically like just a mattress on the concrete floor was the mode of what I lived upon. Um, my kids were very frantic because of all the weird events going on around us of the hate, of the racist hate, I'll put it like that. And when I didn't see anybody as being different from me, just humans as being humans, but apparently that wasn't enough. So no matter how I meshed with the culture, it was never enough. Finally, I prayed, oh dear God, you know all things, release me from this, in, from this environment. So my children and I were taken out of that environment and um, brought back home. I'm still in extreme confusion at this point. And I had even had epileptic seizures in Pakistan. But when I did the MRI and the CCT scans and everything, they said, there's nothing wrong with you. And I said, no, there's definitely something wrong. And they said, no, because these things leave lesions upon the brain, just like you had a stroke. You've never had anything. In fact, your neurons are like one of the best we've ever seen. And I was like, no, this cannot be. And I did three or four times I did these tests. And each time I was being informed, there's nothing wrong. So I went to Thailand a few years later with my kids um, and I had met a Thai monk and I had a discussion with him. I had also discussed with a few other uh, religious leaders of different various religions and they all told me the same thing. Do you know what is black magic? And I said, well, I, I mean, everybody knows that word, but what does that have to do with my with what happened to me. I just wanted to understand what happened to me. Maybe I was self-inflicting my own fears. I didn't know and I didn't understand. And then the um, Thai man said, look, I'm going to take photos and I'm going to show you. And around me, everything was a haze. And I said, yeah, I, I know that everything's always a haze. My camera is bad on my mobile phone. He said, no, no. It is not your mobile phone. These are the creatures who are 
surrounding you and killing you and eating your life and eating your finances and handy. He said, you have two ready frites and um, these freaking black snakes. I don't even know what they are. And I know this all sounds weird, but this is really what took place. And he said, and you know, the frites, they work with the genies. So if somebody conjured a genie, give me blah, give me blah, then those ifrits are taking it from a third party and you're the third party. You're the target that they're taking from. So I was like, oh, how can this be? Um, I, I really didn't believe it. But I, I called a wonderful man back in America who's a shamanic priest and he told me the same things and he said, I'm going to give you how to get rid of these issues. And I'm going to give you the magical words to extract it from your life forever. So between him and the Thai priest, uh, the, the Thai Buddhist priest, um, they healed me and they helped me and they helped my uh, whole family. And I'm very grateful to them. So today I'm going to talk about, you may not have something so severe in your life, but anything that's a trial in your life, any trials you have, you can extract them all with these three beautiful, sorry, these six beautiful words. Good things are coming my way. With these words, you will have the freedom you desire, the money you crave, the opportunities handed to you, the committed and loving relationship you so wish for, and the help you need. Good things are coming my way. Write them down, put them in your pocket, keep them with you, keep them near your bed. Every morning when you're in the REM state, when you awaken, say it. Good things are coming my way. This is your mantra for the day. Good things are coming my way. May you all have a blessed day.